Well, I just went through the tunnel. I'm headed to Pocosin first for a on-site sharpening job, which is a little bit out of my territory. But I happen to have two ladies in this area that wanted their knives sharpened. One of them has been on my list for six months, and the second one came on my list last week. So, I got enough knives to make the cruise across the tunnel and back. I'll get back to you in a few minutes. Well, I just went through the tunnel. I'm headed to Pocosin first for a on-site sharpening job which is a little bit out of my territory. But I happen to have two ladies in this area that wanted their knives sharpened. One of them has been on my list for six months, and the second one came on my list last week. So I got enough knives to make the cruise across the tunnel and back. I'll get back to you in a few minutes. Second stop has got a slicer, Cuisinart, Wustall, maybe a Henkel. I'm not sure what the little hunting knife is. And four riders. Pretty good little stop too for my excursion. Look at that. I couldn't pass that up. That's uh, six to ten cents cheaper than it is on my side of the river. A deal. I got home. Chris had a lawnmower blade guy dropped off. Might be the cleanest lawnmower blade I ever got. It's just a little one though. Like me for electric lawnmower maybe. But it's clean, like spotless. We've got a couple little spots here. No cleaning required. I like those kind of blades. 